Fear the Walking Dead es una serie derivada de The Walking Dead. La producción nos muestra un punto de vista diferente acerca de la trama original en donde el terror y los sobresaltos también están a la orden del día. La serie ha tenido tanto éxito que ya está en su tercera temporada. Con motivo de su estreno tuvimos la oportunidad de conversar con dos de sus protagonistas quienes nos hablaron de lo que podemos esperar en esta nueva entrega. Vamos a verlos. Pierdes el ojo. Alicia, ve a buscar un vehículo que funcione. Yo buscaré a Travis. Vendré por ti. Amigos de Conexión Claro, me encuentro con Alicia Coleman. Welcome to Conexión Claro. Ah, gracias. Gracias. And welcome to Latin America. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Guys, what can we expect from Fear the Walking Dead Season 3? A lot. Um, season 3 is, I think, our best season yes. yet. It's such fantastic. Uh, new location um, we finally kind of start getting the the family really back together and we start developing these characters from being not knowing what to do in the apocalypse to now really surviving and becoming true warriors of the apocalypse really How does your, each character evolve during the series? You know, we uh, let's see, I, I like to say that like season two was about the deconstruction of all of our characters in many ways. I think that many ways we had to go through certain things. We still didn't know a lot. We were still dealing with, with um, the emotional impact of like killing others, what do we do, choices that we make. And now we move beyond that because now we have, it is now um, you either survive or you die. So we have to make harder decisions quickly. So I think that our, our, our characters, I think Victor Strand is coming back to a little bit of his own ways because he's trying to find the currency in this new world. But also I think that he's also, we've also seen his heart and what makes him tick. And now he's got to, you know, strengthen up and, and find his strength again to, to survive. Creo que puede, creo que puede, creo que puede. <laughs> How is it to work with Latin American people? What do you learn from them? Okay. <laughs> so, yes, yeah. Amazing. I, we've yeah. got such a diverse group of people. We've worked with everyone from um, Panama, obviously, yeah, Brazil. Uh, Brazil, Argentina, Cuba. Yeah. Yeah. We've had, um, obviously, Mexico. And they're uh -huh. all so wonderful and lovely. One of the main things I've noticed is everyone's very chivalrous and polite. We just feel like we've been welcomed in, into people's homes, basically. I mean, people, you know, you get to know their, their family uh, at parties and things like that. And it's like, you really do become a family. And I think just generally working with Latin American people, it's just, you know, culturally, it's just like people are warm, people are um, generous, people, and people work hard, have a very, very strong work ethic. It's funny because we never thought that we would really be so interested in um, uh, this zombie genre and we realize it's really just about our humanity. And it's a great uh, mirror we're holding up to the world. So come and check us out. And it's a lot of fun.